her eye on the ball and her head in the game, Ellen DeGeneres. Well, it's that time of year again. It's time to talk football. Am I right, ladies? You know, a lot of people ask me, they say, why do I do a sports desk? And I do it because uh, I don't know anything about football, and uh, a lot of people don't also. And so I decided, who better to explain it to people who don't understand than someone else who, who, who doesn't understand? So we can try to make sense of this together. And that way, if you're at a party and someone starts talking about the game, instead of, like, you know, leaving the table, you're going to have to, a little something to join in, and you, can, you know a little bit. And... Uh, I can help you out. All right, so let's talk football. First of all, I got a new jacket. Secondly, <laughs> thank you. So we're 48 hours away from what they call the final two games of the playoffs. And let's look at what playoffs means. You're saying to me, I don't even know what that means, Ellen. Playoffs. Well, I'm here to help you with that. Playoffs. Two syllables. Let's separate it. You, you can do that with any word. Play. Of course, they're playing a game, and we know that. They're going to play a game off. We're trying to off somebody. We're trying to not... <laughs> I like the Sopranos off somebody, but you, you want somebody to go away. So it's just as simple as it sounds. Playoffs. Okay. So you have two teams playing. And whoever wins, there's, there's two teams playing and another two teams because there's four teams. And whoever wins one from one, the other, and then they end up in the final one, and then they win the Super Bowl. And the Super Bowl this year is the XLI, and, uh, <laughs> which I thought it meant extra large one. But uh, they're Roman numerals. So X is 10, and L, of course, is 50, and the 1 is 1. And I don't know why they use Roman numerals, because they don't even play football in Italy. They play soccer. <laughs> it should just be Super Bowl 41. Am I right, ladies? <laughs> Let me tell you who's playing the game. Uh, oh, by the way, the NFL, they're very protective of their trademark and logos, so we had to make our own. They won't let us use their logos. So, uh, game one, uh, my hometown, New Orleans, uh, I know who they are because I'm from there. So, uh, the New Orleans Saints, they are playing. And uh, <laughs> the New Orleans Saints are playing the Chicago Bears. $8 bet with Cindy. Uh, she wrote and she thinks the Bears are going to win. And uh, here's the thing. Okay, I, you know, you don't have to know a lot about football. Let's just break it down. A bear is fighting a saint. A bear, if it's, if it's fighting a deer, and I don't even know if there's a game, uh, the football team, the deers or not, but if it's a fighting a deer, of course, the bear's going to win. A, a raccoon, uh, maybe an opossum, uh, a bunny for sure, it's going to rip that thing apart, you know. But a bear against a saint, the saint has supernatural powers. The saint is, it can do a Amazing things, you know. You put a bear. Look at Mother Teresa. She took on, you know. The, the Saints have the edge. The Saints will win. Okay. Who else do we have? We have uh, New, New England Patriots, and uh, and for some reason everybody calls them the Pats. So here are the Pats, and uh, the Pats. The Pats will play the Indianapolis Colts. Now, my prediction is, uh, you know, they're called the Pats. It's, you know, everyone's had a pat. It's like, you know, what's that going to do? It's not a slap. It's not a punch. It's just a pat. It's either annoying or it's slightly encouraging and, and demeaning almost. So you've got the Pats against the Colts, and I've had a couple of those. And uh, once you have a couple of Colts, you can't do much of anything. That really uh, it just takes the edge off, and then you just fall asleep. So... They have a pat and you have a call. I don't think either team will win. I think they'll cancel each other out and they will fall asleep on the field. Uh, the Colts will fall asleep and the Pats will pat them on the head. And um, whoever wins this weekend, uh, they don't get the title. That's the thing. They get jewelry. Well, that's why they play. The, the guys, and that's the best part. They get rings. Who doesn't like jewelry? Am I right, ladies? <laughs> These are my predictions, and I'm sticking to them for now. This has been Ellen DeGeneres from Ellen's Sports Desk. Am I right, ladies?